Hi, I'm Cheryl Lundquist and I am so excited about season three this year. It seems like it's been forever since season two ended and I cannot wait to get started. I love the fact that it's France week because what is more French than French onion soup? Except our French onion soup is going to be extra special because we're going to be using savory garlic Philadelphia cooking cream. It's going to be a creamy French onion soup with cheese melted on toast and nice caramelized onions. So here is uh, the Eiffel Tower we have in the background. So I'm ready to get started with our French. We do to make our French Philly French onion soup. I have taken in a skillet. I put uh, two tablespoons of unsalted butter and a tablespoon of oil over medium low heat and let that melt. To that, I added five yellow onions that I've kind of rough chopped. I covered the dish and let that sit. I completely did not stir it. I let it sit for 30 minutes. And to that, I sprinkled a pinch of sugar, a little bit of salt, and a little bit of pepper. And what we have now are these nice, soft onions. Now I'm going to turn the heat up to high, and I'm going to add a cup of red wine. What we want is to let this reduce by half. And then we'll add our other ingredients on high to reduce our liquid by half. I'm just going to transfer my onions to a soup pan. Pour them all in here. Very nice. I'm going to turn the pan now on low. And to that, I'm going to add four cups of beef stock. Now, the best part, we're going to add five ounces of cooking cream, savory garlic flavor, and we go. Give it a good stir. Cooking cream will melt as the pan begins to heat. Oh, it smells delicious already. Can you not imagine sitting outside in Paris in a cafe on a, on a cool day or a damp day with a nice warm bowl of Philly French onion soup. That's a dream come true right there. It's a beautiful caramel color. Last thing we're gonna do is add one bay leaf. I'm gonna set my timer for 45 minutes and walk away. And when this is finished, um, about the last 10 minutes or so, we're gonna preheat our oven and we're gonna toast some bread with some Gruyere cheese on it. It's gonna be so good. My 45 minutes have passed. I've preheated my oven to 400 degrees and I have toasted a piece of thick toast. I'm going to ladle this deliciousness into a crock. I'm just going to show you how to make one serving. Oh, it so, smells so good. And I'm going to put our toast on top. Let it get down in there and soak a little bit and then top it with this wonderful shredded Gruyere cheese. And don't be shy. You know how it gets ooey and gooey and melts all over the top? That's the best part. There we go. And I'm just gonna stick it in the oven and bake it for 10 to 15 minutes till all the cheese is nice and melted. It's gonna be wonderful.